Hey guys, we're wrapping up here in Washington, D.C. and just kind of give you a rundown of what's happening. We're in the appropriation process, and of course, during the appropriation process, um, uh, the Democrats' answer to inflation is make government bigger. So they're wanting to increase government size by 14%. So bureaucracy is the answer to solving inflation issues because the heavy-handed government has done so good at controlling it so far. And when we start talking about gas prices, energy prices, which is truly the backbone of our economy, which is causing a lot of the inflation to take place because you can't produce a product or deliver a product without energy, Pete Buttigieg's solution to this, which is our Secretary of Transportation, by the way, says it's a silver lining for an opportunity for us to move away from fossil fuels and to go into renewables. Wow. What an individual that's out of touch with the rest of the country. Maybe the rest of the world. But that's par for what the Democrats are doing here in Washington, D.C. anyways. This is what happens when you have a weak leader in the White House. He hires weak people to run agencies that's literally trying to control our lives. And the Democrats here being ran by Nancy Pelosi is trying to reward them because they're doing such a great job that says, hey, let's increase your budget by an average of 14% across the board. Wow, they are in touch with America. Guys, this is exactly why we don't need Washington DC influencing us. We need to be influencing Washington DC. So thank you for this opportunity to fight for Oklahoma values. May God bless you and may God bless the United States of America.